We've obviously got some problems, uh, each of us individually, and uh, we have to remember that this is our serenity, our peace and quiet, our sanctuary from <clears throat> that shit out there. So leave it out the door. But let's let's just keep here, here, keep all the other bullshit out there, because this I love this place. I really do. So let's, you know, just remember that this is, this is something special. I came into this shelter here, this very shelter uh, last year, around that same September when I lost my house. And uh, lo and behold, I saw people wearing soccer uniform, shoes, boots, and socks, a ball. I said, man, what are you guys doing? I said, they're playing soccer, they, there's a gym. I said, I was just here one or two days, the first night or so. I said, there's a gym in a shelter? I was like, I can't believe that. <laughs> and they said, come, yeah, you know how to play? I said, yeah, man. They said, come, come play. That, uh, you know. I came and I saw it and I liked it and I've been with them ever since. And it was through this same uh, group of young men here that I got the information of how to be able to do that exam, win that grant and go back to school. So it's been a, a blessing to me. You know, uh, the difficulties that you don't have money to do a lot of the things you want to do, but I decided to better myself, you know? Better and, uh, I'm part of this team and this Street Soccer uh, USA program for life. So Street Soccer USA is a sport for social change organization, which means that we use the power of sport uh, to build relationships, uh, trust, and to create a platform that we can deliver services that help change people's lives. The issues that they face that keep them homeless are really no different than the issues um, everyone has at every level of society. I became homeless because we had to close shop in the real estate and the mortgage office because uh, of the uh, 2007 and 2008 uh, economic uh, depression affected the affected our business very much. Uh, our core um, group that we work with are really the least served uh, in the United States, which are homeless teens and adults aged 16 and up. It's a good thing because. Uh, if that didn't happen, I won't be a part of this thing. I won't be back in school. I won't have a refocus into myself and my life and think about, you know, what do I want to do for the next 20 years or 30 years as long as I have good health? And what uh, legacy do I want to leave for my wife, my children, you know? The issue is when you're on the bottom end of, the, uh, of society in, in terms of, um, you know, wealth and income, and, uh, you just get pushed that much farther down by the same issues. So they're, you know, become exacerbating factors that keep people homeless. Street soccer is about building that support system back, and we use the kind of unlikely uh, sport of soccer, um, but it makes, it makes a lot of sense uh, in the sense that that's what people like most, um, is a sense of community. As we speak, I'm a student of St. John's University. I'm doing a business administration. I intend to do my MBA. And uh, I want a grant. I want a grant uh, through the uh, school, through my school and the DHS. And uh, the grant helps me with my school, my books, my tuition, my, uh, my food, transportation, and even my housing and also my family if they want to go to school too, so it's a beautiful thing.